Hello PowerPoint users and welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, we are going to create this beautiful team intro animation using PowerPoint. In this template, each profile picks and their designations will roll over in opposite direction and no doubt your audience will be impressed after seeing this animation. So without any further delay, let's get started. As usual, let's first go to view tab and then enable the guides. Under the same tab, Let's click on slide master option. At the bottom, you will see few default placeholders. Just drag over to select and then delete them. Next go to insert placeholder option and then choose picture option. Draw a picture placeholder to match the height of this slide and then apply black color outline just to see its boundaries. Let's zoom out a bit and then drag and place this picture placeholder at the bottom edge of the slide. Let's zoom out still more. Duplicate this picture placeholder using Ctrl plus D and align both the shapes one below the other as shown. Let's zoom out even more. Duplicate this picture placeholder four more times to make it total of six, obviously for six profiles and make sure they are arranged one below the other as shown. Finally. Just click on close master view option to close the slide master. Next let's zoom in a bit. Then go to layout option. And then select the layout which we have created just now using slide master option. You will see all 6 picture placeholders now appear one below the other. Let's select all picture placeholders using ctrl plus A and then remove their outline. Now click on the picture icon at the middle of each picture placeholders. Choose your profile images and then click on insert to add them. Since I have 6 picture placeholders, I will add 6 images as shown. Let me go to slide number 2 and copy meet our team text onto slide number 1. Align it centrally to slide and we are done with the first slide. Next select slide number 1. Right click and then choose duplicate slide. Let me delete the meet our team text from slide number 2. Then select all picture placeholders using ctrl plus a shortcut key. Then move all images upward until first image perfectly aligns with the slide height. Next duplicate slide number 2. Select all picture placeholders. And move all images upward until second image perfectly aligns with the slide height. Follow the same steps to duplicate the slide 4 more times and align the images in sequence to match them with respective slide heights. So if we have done it in a right way, slide number 7 must have the last image aligned to its height. Next let me go to slide number 8. Copy name and other text field and paste it onto slide number 2. Align them as per the requirement and then let me add a numerical value at the end of both text fields just to differentiate its content from other slides. Now copy both the text fields, paste it onto slide number 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 but remember to change the last numerical value from both the text fields. Again, just to differentiate its content from other slides. Next let me go to slide number 8. Then copy designation text fields and paste it onto slide number 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Basically on all the slides where we have profile pictures. Now let me select this slide number 1. Go to insert tab. Select shapes and then draw a rounded rectangle shape. Make it completely rounded. Rotate it by 90 degrees. Remove its outline and then change its fill color to any color of your choice. Let me drag and place this rectangle shape on top of this slide. You may have to use this scroll bar on the right side to move this slide and it will move with very little distance because of profile images but that should be fine. Adjust and align this shape on the top. Let's adjust the size of the rectangle shape. Copy it 
and paste it onto slide number 2. Now on slide number 2, let's smooth the rectangle shape on top of designation 1 text field and then send it to back. Make sure it is centrally aligned to the text. Next go to slide number 3 and then paste the rectangle shape. Let's smooth the rectangle shape on top of designation 2 text field and then send it to back. Follow the same step and paste the rectangle shape onto slide number 4, 5, 6 and 7. Move the rectangle shape on top of respective designation fields and then send them to back. Next let me go to slide number 2. Select the designation 1 text field and then increase its font size. Make sure it is perfectly aligned within the rectangle shape and then change its font color to white. Now with designation 1 text field selected, click on format painter option, go to slide number 2 and apply this format to designation 2 text field. Make sure to align it perfectly within the rectangle shape. Again choose the format painter option, go to slide number 3, apply this format to designation 3 text field and align it perfectly within the rectangle shape. Repeat the steps for designation 4, 5 and 6 text fields. Finally, align all designation text fields to left and that will finalize this design. So we are all set. Now select all the slides. Go to transition tab and then apply morph transition. And then set the duration to 1 second. So here is the final preview of this beautiful team intro animation. Hope you all liked it. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share and comment on this video. Stay tuned for next tutorial.